Hey guys, today I'm going to be talking about something incredibly interesting. We're going to be talking about Dora. I'm actually planning on doing a playlist or a total course for this particular tool. So what is Dora to begin with? Well, it's a no code design tool that lets you create landing pages, designs, so on and so forth, and actually convert them directly into websites. The good thing about Dora is it's not a simple tool like Framer or Figma, not to say that these are <laughs> these are simple tools, but I'm basically talking about the flexibility that Dora offers. So Dora offers a lot of flexibility with CSS animations, 3JS, WebGL. You don't have to learn anything about these things. It's actually gonna do your job for you. Uh, do let me know if this is something that you're interested in. I also have actually invite so again if you actually go to dora.run as you can see you can join the waitlist or you can sign in there's no option to sign up right now but i have exclusive invites for my subscribers my viewers my followers so if you want those invites do follow me on linkedin twitter do subscribe on my youtube channel and do hit me up in the comments if you're interested in actually exploring this tool i'm not going to be exploring the tool immediately right now as i mentioned i actually am going to do, going to be doing an actual course on this whole tool um, and actually creating a website which is pretty interactive but for now i'm just going to be showing the landing page itself of dora and what you can do with it so for example there's a really amazing keyframe feature that is pretty similar to after effects where you can actually animate your content you can make 3d animations as well this is exactly something that you would be able to do in dora directly similarly you have constraints layout constraint layout actually helps you to create layouts and technologies that are very flexible and again they're going to be extremely beneficial to you as well similarly you can actually build your designs for any different screens you can have those animations come in you have a responsive feature as well and it's not just about like those 2d animations which you see on some of the other creators where they actually place certain elements and they just rotate it or skew it using figma that's not going to happen we're actually going to be building 3d animation landing pages and stuff along those lines some examples of those 3d animation landing pages that we'll be creating are these so here's one example so as you can see, if you're scrolling down, we have this 3D object actually working based on my scroll. So again, if I stop scrolling, nothing's working. This is not a video, again, mind you. This is actually a 3D interactive animation that works on my scroll. Similarly, if I go here on another side, this is another animation that actually happens, not an animation, this is another 3D object that actually animates directly on scroll. You don't have to learn coding for it. You don't have to learn CSS. You don't have to learn WebGL or 3JS for this. Though obviously you can do the same thing or pretty similar things if you actually know how to code in 3JS and WebGL. WebGL, you would be able to do something like this, but with this particular tool, you don't need to do that. I was actually told by the one of the creators of this particular tool who actually spoke to me that this particular site that you see in front of you takes about two days for people to create in their tool directly. So they just have to design it and then they can export it. Now I'm actually scrolling down. Now, as you can see, we have the content coming in on the left and we have this animation as well that happens on scroll. I mean, can you imagine that? If I actually scroll a bit slow, you can see that the animation is zooming in. I'm actually going inside here. Then all of this fancy stuff is happening. This is expanding. This video itself is expanding and collapsing based on where I am. I mean, isn't that amazing? So the power that this particular tool offers you is insane. It's off the charts. I don't think we have any tool that at the very least I've explored right now that can come close to what we have here. Uh, this I don't think is gonna be your standard UI design tool. This is gonna be a much more advanced tool, not in terms of the skill that it requires, rather in terms of the output that it generates. Similarly, this is another example of it. I'm gonna scroll down. As you can see, this is an iPad Air page that's actually created by this tool it's in itself and you have a lot of these animations coming in scrolling based on my scroll. This whole thing is actually being generated on scroll. I'm actually scrolling really slow so you can see it. I mean, how amazing is that? Here is another example of something that actually you can create using this particular tool. I mean, there's a lot of things that I can actually show and showcase, but we're going to be covering this tool and the nuances and actually creating a website and a pretty interactive website in this course. Hit me up if you're interested in, in actually that particular course. 
And obviously it's gonna be a free course. I'm actually gonna host it on YouTube. And if you're interested in actually getting that exclusive invite from me, uh, if you want that invite, definitely go ahead, subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on LinkedIn and Twitter, and I'll see you on the other side. Hopefully I'm actually going to be leaving those exclusive invites in throughout my course. So definitely do hit me up. So that's pretty much it. Do let me know if you're interested. Do let me know if you're hyped up, excited, and let's just get started. Take care.